are sitting here tonight because God has allowed it. Oh, yeah. And many of us who have testimonies that we really should not have been here. Uh, even if we were here, we shouldn't have been in our right mind. Uh, but God has been faithful. Uh, it's been a very interesting year for me. And uh, for me to return back to the place where I had to put my sister to rest is never easy. Uh, you know, the church knows, I don't know where the church gets so many masks from. Uh, um, and I'm not dogging this out because I'm church. But sometimes when you're hurt, just say you're hurt. Uh, people understand you a little bit better instead of you trying to act like you're feeling something and you're really hurt. Yeah. Genuinely, people can love you when you're fair with them, to be honest with them. Yeah. And so when I came here today, I always land here in Newark and I always have mixed emotions because it's almost been a year since Miss Whitney Houston left us. Yeah. And uh, can we celebrate my sister? people genuinely, like I just got through singing about, mm. it didn't matter what they do, you just love them. Mm. No matter what the world says, you love them. And I loved her from such a deep place. And I'll ask those who know how to pray and get prayer through beyond the ceiling uh, to keep me in your prayers because every day is a process. Mm. And um, I went across the country first few months singing I Look to You mm. because I needed to get over it. I wish it was a piano player, I'd sing a little bit of it. But, uh, <laughs> it's just my therapy, you know? And uh, as I lay me down, uh -huh. heaven hear me now, I'm lost without <coughs> cause, after giving it my all. Winter storms have come and darkened my sun. But after all that I've been through, who on earth can I turn to? I look to you. I look to you. After all my strength is gone. In you I hear a song, I look to you, ooh, I look to you. And when melodies are gone, in you I hear a song, I look to you. As she was saying, was about to lose. <laughs> My breath. <laughs> no more fighting. Left. She, uh, I always lose my words when I start talking about her. But she gets that. I look to you.
Cassie. We were in Germany in 2010, and we were in her hotel room because she was on tour. And I'd gone over to be by her side because she was working hard. And she'd been out there about six months. So she said, Sissy, I'm tired of this. She said, we got three more months out here. And something has erupted, some volcano, and something's in my throat. I said, I'm on the way. You really come? See, yeah. I jumped on a plane and I flew to Germany. That's what love does. Yeah. I didn't go to be in concert. I didn't go to see what movie deal we could do together. I went to be there for her. Because that's what love does. I didn't do it for a check. Because I set the record straight, I didn't get a check. <laughs> I was making sure that when God does his checklist. Yeah. Hey, thank you. Woo! You'll see that I meant it from the heart. I stayed out there for a few days, and we went around and she said, through through me. I said, I hear you. Through me in the day, dangers. Mm -hmm. I did that. Toss, <laughs> toss and snares. Lord, Lord, ooh, I have, I have already. Save the strong with a message of Dr. King. And 